A Thunder Bay man has entered a guilty plea in a high-profile art fraud case. Gary Lamont appeared in a Thunder Bay courtroom today. Lee Newman was there and she joins us live in studio. Lee? Thanks, Riley. Lamont pleaded guilty to two charges today. He's one of eight people who were arrested earlier this year in relation to the production and sale of fake Norval Morisot paintings. Thunder Bay police previously said they believe it's the biggest case of art fraud in the world in world history worth an estimated $100 million. Gary Lamont is alleged to be one of the main ringleaders in the years-long art fraud, which came to light in the documentary There Are No Fakes. Police say the eight accused forged thousands of fake Norval Morisot paintings valued at roughly $15,000 on average. Lamont pleaded guilty in court Monday to two counts, one count of forgery for the creation of false artworks attributed to Morisot, and one count of fraud over $5,000. At a second hearing scheduled for December 14th, the Crown will ask for the withdrawal of the remaining charges against Lamont, as well as the charges against one co-accused, 59-year-old Linda Tachuk, also of Thunder Bay. Lamont will also face sentencing at that time. The court is expecting a fairly large attendance as victims are being invited to attend the hearing if they intend to seek restitution or wish to make a victim impact statement. All identified victims should be receiving notification from the Crown. The Crown is also seeking the forfeiture of the forged paintings and will be reaching out to third parties who may be in possession of the forgeries. Police encourage anyone who believe they may be in possession of a forged Morisot to contact a lawyer. Lee Noonan, TBT News.